Hey guys, this is Antario and I got a battle here versus Steven Jones from Serbia FA chatroom. He's a pretty good battler, the battle was quite okay and he bring in some cool pokes like Minion as Elite, which I actually uh, used to do uh, in my previous battle, so this kind of reminds me when I was doing that. So I decided to upload this battle and um, yeah, I decided to lead my team with Omaster as he lead with his minion as I said before and he was for a substitute as I go for a spikes because I've come to realize that he isn't going to do uh, much to me with this minion. So then he goes for Encore and I just need to uh, repeat my previous move which is spikes. So now I got the second layer of spikes and I decided to take a switch into my directory as he goes for agility twice just to build up its speed. And when he do that I've come to realize that this is his button passing uh, minion. So I just go keep using Earthquake because it's super effective move on that and he actually can switch because of the arena trap so uh, when he create another sub I've come to realize that he is uh, going to uh, activate its berry and this turns out to be his Petaya berry which will boost its special attack stats so now I need to fear some kind of special uh, sweeper because he is going to button pass it all to uh, one of his uh, special pokes which is Octillery. So I go for Earthquake, which will do some nice uh, damage to this Octillery, and it barely survives this on its red health, and I was like, fuck! Because this Octillery is carrying um, some kind of berry, which will uh, heal it a bit, so <laughs> this was so fucking random. And after that, I bring in my Lapras, creating some obvious surf, which will, you know, isn't going to affect my Lapras thanks to my ability. And after that, thanks God that uh, he's got only one uh, special attack boost, because my Lapras is going to survive uh, an obvious energy ball. And I go for Ice Shard previous turn, and because I was so fucking retarded. And after that, I decide to go for a Waterfall just to finish off this guy, because it can be really uh, fearsome in late games, so the, he, here is a pretty huge threat taken by me by that, so uh, then he brings in his Magishamp and I decide to predict and fighting type move, so I go for my scary mojo because that move isn't very effective on my scary mojo, so he goes for a power trick and I go for a trick just to trap it with uh, using some kind of move and he decides to lock himself into high jump kick, which isn't going to be very effective on my scary mojo and I set up some salt rock, so after that he goes for it again as I go for explosion because Unfortunately for me, all of my pokes got weakness to the fighting type moves, so I decided to take this poke by that, and yeah. So after that, I bring in my Oma Star as I uh, do at the beginning of this battle, and he brings in Precious, his uh, Tauros. Uh, so uh, my Oma Star got intimidated, but it doesn't matter, because I go for a knockoff, and he goes for Earthquake, which is uh, pretty effective on my Oma Star. And I knock off his life orb, so now I'm pretty sure it isn't going to be a one-hit KO. So I decided to set up the third layer of spikes, because it's always good to have three of them on the field. And yeah, after that he decided to go for the uh, return for some random reason, and uh, my, my almost star survived this, which is so fucking random. And um, yeah, I misclick spikes here, because I thought that he's going to take me down by the earthquake which he do uh, next turn, so yeah. After that I bring in my Katondok just to get this thing intimidated, and after that I decided to go for Will-O-Wisp, I guess, as he death fodder his minion, because he wants to uh, see what uh, my Katondok is like, and yeah. After that he brings in his Precious again, and he will suffer because of the spikes and self rocks. so now he's on its uh, low health, so I decided to just finish off with Fire Blast, do not uh, trying to risk and go for a Willowisp, just straight forward to the Fire Blast, and after that he brings in his Slowking, and I was like, fuck, now this poke is going to KO my Arcanine. So I decided to go for Toxic, predicting his uh, some kind of status move or some kind of uh, status booster. So he goes for Calm Mind, and now I got this thing Poison, so I'm not quite fearing that. And I decided to predict some kind of Water type move, but he goes for a Psychic, which is good part prediction of his. And um, after that, uh, he will suffer because of the poison, and I bring in my Magnetov because I thought that I'm able to KO it with super effective Thunderbolt stuff, but unfortunately not, so he just take me down with Flamethrower, and this even don't make sense because like a big water dog which is uh, throwing flames, and this is so fucking ridiculous, but you know, whatever, what does make sense in pokes, to be honest with you, so um, yeah. He, he uh, killed itself with this uh, poison, and now he's got only one poke left, which is his Lithion. He decided to risk and go for Sorosens, and I go for a Fire Blast, 
because um, this is a super effective move and he just wants to, you know, risk uh, if my Fire Blast will miss, but it didn't, so yeah, that was a good game. Steven Jones, um, pretty close one, and no, not pretty close one. So, yeah, comment, subscribe, guys, hope you like this battle, and see you guys later, peace, dudes.